Hello and welcome to the session. In this session we are going to discuss the following question and the question says that the table shows the percentage of Mr. Lawson's income spent in each category per month. Draw a circle graph to represent the data. If Mr. Lawson's monthly salary is $2,285, then how much amount is spent on food? We know that a circle graph is a graph in the form of a circle that is divided into sectors with each sector representing a part of a set of data and to draw a circle graph we need to find the appropriate angle measure for each sector such that the sum of angles of all the sectors is 360 degrees. With this key idea we shall proceed to the solution. We are given a table which shows the per month expenditure of Mr. Lawson in percentage. It is given that Mr. Lawson spends 25% of his income on rent, 20% of his income on savings, 30% of his income is spent on food, 10% of his income is spent on clothing and 15% of his income is spent on other items. Now we have to draw its circle graph. From the key idea we know that to draw a circle graph we need to find the appropriate angle measure for each sector such that the sum of angles of all the sectors is 360 degrees. Here, since we are given percentages, so we directly find the angle measure for each category by multiplying each percentage with 360 degrees. So first we find angle measure for category rent now, 25% is spent on rent, so its degree measure will be equal to 25% of 360 degrees and this is equal to 25 upon 100 into 360 degrees. On solving it further, we get 2 into 5 is 10 and 2 into 18 is 36. 5 into 5 is 25. So now we are left with 5 into 18 degrees which is equal to 90 degrees. So angle measure for rent is 90 degrees. Similarly, angle measure for savings will be equal to 20% of 360 degrees and this is equal to 20 upon 100 into 360 degrees and this is equal to 2 into 5 is 10 and 5 into 72 is 360. So this is equal to 72 degrees. So angle measure for savings is 72 degrees. Similarly, angle measure for food will be equal to 30% of 360 degrees. That is equal to 30 upon 100 into 360 degrees. 
and this is equal to 3 into 36 degrees that is 108 degrees. So angle measure for food is 108 degrees. Similarly, angle measure for clothing is equal to 36 degrees and angle measure for other items is equal to 54 degrees. So now we have got the angle measure for rent is 90 degrees, for savings it's 72 degrees, for food it's 108 degrees, for clothing it's 36 degrees and for other items it's 54 degrees. Here we should note that sum of all angle measures that is 90 degrees plus 72 degrees plus 108 degrees plus 36 degrees plus 54 degrees is equal to 360 degrees. Now we shall draw the circle graph. First we draw a circle. Now angle measure for category rent is 90 degrees. So using protractor we measure 90 degrees and draw the sector. Now we label it rent with percentage 25. Now using protractor we draw the sectors for all the other categories with the given angle measure and label them accordingly. So this is the required circle graph showing Mr. Lawson's monthly expenditure. Now, if Mr. Lawson's monthly salary is $2,285, then we have to find how much amount is spent on food. And we are given that 30% of his income is spent on food so amount spent on food will be equal to 30% of his income that is $2,285 and this is equal to 30 upon 100 into 2,285 dollars. Now, on solving it further, we get 685.5 dollars. So, we say that 685.5 dollars are spent on food per month and this is the required answer. This completes our session. Hope you enjoyed this session.